you're all good on you're all safe from that bomb our aircraft is like taking out got a second plane coming in high he missed that's good that's good one looks like it's coming back towards you one's coming back towards you on your right on your right on your right No bombs for you. Nice bait and switch, nice bait and switch there. Other planes going down. Yep, got it taken care of by a teammate. Yeah. Now we just hold the three points and we should be good. Oh, we should be good, but you never know what can happen. Yeah, I don't think there's many of them left now. There's like three or two, three of them left. Let's see where they yeah, are. Yeah, maybe. Oh, okay, those are both carcasses. Okay, that's good. The two things directly in front of you are both carcasses. That's the, that's that's the good news. The bad news is I cannot see any enemies from where I am. Even though I'm looking directly over you, I cannot see any enemies right now. See, it's a plane. One of them's in a plane still. The other two is unknown. Let me check. Let me check the stats map. There's five. There's five of them still alive in total. Yep. There's one, two, three, four, five. There's eight of you guys still alive. Alright, I'm pushing up. Probably gonna die trying this. So, what I'm gonna recommend trying to do here is taking out Obsed UFO if you can ever find him. Oh, I think I just saw his flash. Check for muzzle. Uh, right side, right side. Hard right, hard right side. Him. Should be str I can't see him directly because he might have dipped back under. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Got my we win, though. We win. But I got you. Mm. <laughs> I got the kill. <laughs> nice. Yeah, Brains is a good tree, guys. It's a really amazing tree. Not at all, it's totally suffering and pain every time you play the tank. For the fucking amazing amazingness of these this this country's tech 8000 to repair the AMX 13 how much is it for that 3000 2000 all right medium tanks in the daca it is <laughs> i'm going to get heat on this M56 tato launcher you want to know what the fucking um shell thing is for my for my AMX M4, APC it's, yeah APC two fifteen millimeters of pen. That's pretty good actually. Don't know how much explosive power it has, but mm, it tells you how many kilograms. I can't fucking read it then. Projectile mass. 10.06 point, no because no, oh. it's a capped right so the cap is the thing that does all the damage right pretty sure the cap is like the explosive part that makes it allows it to penetrate yeah oh boy Oops. now I'm going to remember to remove HE shells from this thing I only have M32 shots until I can get the heat shells, so let's see. Oh, that thing. It's basically like firing a fucking pepper shell at everything. Alright. Alright, looks like I'm gonna probably go for the road. Yeah. That leads up to B. I'll follow you down. Shit. Going for a long side. Going for the expect long play. Them to be flank expect them to be uh, right around that road. Yeah. I kind of figured they'd be going that way anyway. Because most teams on this map have the same similar, like a similar idea. They're going to try to outflank each other. So, easiest way to outflank the other team. Here, basically, and watch this whole road. Yeah. And I can basically be out there as well. I'm not functioning though, as any round, but... though, I'm not sure where to aim that well with this type of round. So, I don't expect to actually penetrate much. Uh, what kind of round shells. is it? Uh, it's the armor-piercing composite, the rigid ones. 
Oh, you just want to aim at turrets for that shit. Turret, well, basically weak points in the turret and weak points in the hull. If you hit those, they're probably from done for. I mean, that's, that's, if, that's if I can pen through them. Me Especially already just traversing my much. turret, so I can fucking yeet my shells down that direction. Oh, we got an EBR. Yeah, backing that's... up. Why are you backing up, EBR? I know there's somebody down there, but I gotta take a pot shot. So do you. You're fast. Outrun them. They wasted missed, their shell. Take a shot. You wasted a shell. Take a shot. Oh, I blocked it. And I'm there goes their trans. There goes their transmission for the Jag. There's also, um, there's a light tank, and then there's also two other tanks down there, so be careful. Yeah, fuck, he took out my, uh... Back it up. Reverse gear. He took out my cannon from my gunner. No! KDR! You will be remembered! I don't have parts. EBR, you. The, 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 this is a fresh fucking vehicle for me, man. Oh, Jesus, what the fuck was that? M oh, uh, an M40 fucking in, uh, one. Okay. Oh, that fast little L, that fast little car. Help me repair, EBR. Thank you. I'm all the way, I have parts in this thing. The the thing is, the SA50 is really good at sort of like just taking, um, I don't think it much, but like this, fucking just. No, I don't have a machine gun on this. You kind of don't. No, I don't. I only have two crew left. Rip. I'm already on my second tank, and it's not even, like, halfway through the battle. <laughs> like, our team's pushing down there, so we're fine. Fair enough. Oh, I might go with the ARL, too, because the ARL has, like, the same shell as the AMX, too, so... That might be a yeah. good option. But I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna aim straight down the end of that road, find a good spot, and just start popping shells down that oh, way. Hold up. Oh, that's machine gun, Leopard 1, shit. Oh, Leo 1s, okay. We're gonna have a field day now, boys. An yeah, SA 50, a Sherman versus a Leo 1. Who's gonna win? Probably the Leo. But I'm gonna put up one hell of a fight. I'm coming over. Yep. You also have a tank destroyer down that road too. Yeah. If I can try to take out the TD first, I can then focus the Leo, but at the same time I don't know if I'm gonna be able to really do much to the Leo with that armor and shape. Oh, I'm on my way. There you go. I might be- I should be fine. The Leo won't be able to penetrate my frontal armor? So I should be fine. Bounce the Leo! On my way. Keep it covered. I'm trying. I'm using my own dead character as a shield here. Oh, damn. That's a shit ton of them there. Oh, he yeah. got another bomb. Nice. Three bombs. There's only one guy left. Yeah, I'm keeping my eyes open right now. He's currently marked, so we can see him where he is. Sorta. I don't take a pot shot again. I hear bomb. You yep. Fucking German premium thing, I think. Fucking German premium. I hate those German jets. Fucking yeah, they're they're honestly bullshit in this game. All right. Well, I got a bunch of tag carcasses here, so maybe we can use this as cover. I'm gonna use my ant here because that's the only thing I can use right now. Where is this accursed German? Oh God, this thing is fucking cursed already. I love it. We got smoke shells. Nice. Oh, I hear another plane. Is that ours? Tell me that's nobody else down there while I push up when the smoke dissipates. Ah. Hmm. Got him. 
and who's watching the B point now. That jet's coming back, I think. Yeah. Fucking firebrand, the fuck is that piece of shit? Oh, it's British, makes sense. Shit to begin with. Ha. I will say this, France, the playstyle of France does remind me a bit of like a mixture of um, the American playstyle, like the play, way you want to play the American tree with like. Can't pen this guy, I don't know what oof. it is overwhelming firepower and then like there's the other option too with like it being more like the um german tree as well missile that you missed missed but this guy's got a i took out it i don't know what that is you shot the missile but i took out his uh gas tank well that's good you have friendly t-34 coming up to help you too I got a hit, but somebody's on my right. I got yep. my driver. What is it? I don't know what it is. But our teammate got him. That's good. But the one that shot the rocket at me is still alive. Hmm. Oh, yep, still alive. Don't know what he is, where he is, but I can't see him. Got a kill assist on him, there's another one there. Yep. We good. I have four men, four <laughs> crew left. That's always Out helpful. Five. Another kill assist. Alright, where's this guy? He's on his mark. Bell T-34, I'll come and help you repair. I need to get my man back. Yeah, just keep your eyes on that right side. Nice. Keep that up. Reloading. 16 seconds. I just have to get used to France, I think, right? I, I just need to get used to France, like the place of how they are used oh, and everything. Oh, that's a big bomb. Yeah, that, that is a pretty big bomb and you're oh, dead. Oh, that's a bomber. <laughs> a bomber yep. got me. Alright, right, not bad. Are you dead, dead? Oh. Or are you still alive? No, I got enough points to spawn in. I think I almost have enough for... No, I don't have enough for nuke yet. Damn. Jeez. Oh, the E1. Oh, that's gonna be fucking fun. Not really. I don't like the Pershing, honestly. Pershing's actually pretty good if you know how to angle the front armor. It's just the penetration values isn't that great, even though it has yeah. a decent cannon. Fair enough, but... Initially, like, it used to be, I think, around 6.3 until they bumped it to 6.7. It was fine where it was, in all honesty, where you could actually pen stuff and stuff mm -hmm. could still potentially pen you, but now it looks like everything can just one-shot you. Well, that's the thing, like, they need to stop moving things around when it comes to their BR ratings in this game. Like, they need to just, like, say, okay, this is gonna stay at this BR because this works at this BR fine. There's no real, like, game-breaking issues like, with uh, it, you know? Or BMPs as well. Why so? Why did it have BMP such a low? That should be like 9.0 or 8. I think they should have them 7.7 7 minimum. I mean, at least 8.0, because their rockets literally can one shot regardless. Yeah. Even top tier. I mean, the most annoying things I hate is just going up against BMPs. Well, that's the thing. Like, I hate the BMPs. But the one thing that I always hate, and this is the one thing I will honestly admit that I do hate. German tanks in general in this game. Eh, I don't mind German so much. 
so much because the uh, ones I do, do I just like well. The well, ones main I ones do I don't like. like the main ones I pepper. don't like facing is Leo's. I also don't really like facing Tiger Twos and the so later Panthers. Because, like, with the Tiger 2 and the later Panthers, right, I haven't figured out the exact point to hit to one-shot them yet. And that's the thing, I like being able to know where I can, like, eventually either one-shot or multi-shot kill. But with the Tigers and, like, the Tiger 2 and the Panther 2, or 2, but, uh, just the Panther in general, I do not know where I should, where I should will be able to one-shot them from, you know? And I like knowing that beforehand, because, like... And with the American stuff too, I don't know really where to one shot on those either. Hence why I've mainly played the American stuff. I mean, you just you just gotta know where to shoot. Well, that's the thing. Like, I know where to shoot on a lot of vehicles, but at the same time, like, it's just so fucking confusing some of the time with how like, if if this tank does an angle slightly more than what they have, it's gonna be an insta bounce instead of an insta kill. Either way, though, like, it's not a big deal. Oh, that didn't. Oh, shit. That's a leopard and a... We've captured most of the strategic zone. Doesn't matter, we won. Now oh, you ain't gonna get a kill on me. Ha. <laughs> Surprisingly, my shell did nothing to that leopard front frontally. Huh. It literally... It didn't even hit the turret ring. Uh, y'all down for some 3-7 for the next round. Sure. Just because I want to use the ram. The ram is a fun tank to use. Oh, I just got random five random backups. Nice. Mm, nice. <coughs> now my ram is even more canadian fied I put another Canadian symbol on it. More Canada. We need more Canada. 3.7, right? Yeah, 3.7. Alright, let me recruit some of this. The reason why I say 3.7 is because like, I want to do a battle on the ram because the ram is really fun. Because like, when you're using the ram, like, yeah, you can get instantly kill that it is easy to pull that shit off but if you're having fun with it and you know what you're doing then like you know it becomes a lot easier to use three seven three point three if you wonder what my lineup is just the ram the sherman and the m10 and then the p63 and the a20 that's my lineup for this shit. I gotta get rid of my 4.0s. Right back here. Don't worry. 3.3, 3.7, 2.7, 4.7, nope. Alright, bring in AA. Why not? But yeah, just, we're doing some 3.7 for the fun of it now, because why not? 3.7 is like the fun BR at this point. I'm just gonna put it in chat so um, KDR knows to do 3.7. Here we go. Oh, I put KD. Fuck. I meant to say KDR. I'm sorry. Now I feel bad. Hmm. Should I bring the Lee or should I bring the M M uh, four A three? Hmm. M four A three in general probably do would probably do better. Especially when it has the 67 shot, the heat shell. It would do better if it went, if it had that. Probably. Why not? All right, done. Crewing. Because while the Lee, yes, the Lee is decent enough. I said the Lee would be better overall. Well, yeah, but has more penetration. Yeah, but no. KDR, can you switch down to 3.7? Please, and thank you. Thank you. 
just said that wrong. <laughs> I'm bringing the Lee, because I prefer the penetration over the, the heat shell. Yeah, uh, fair enough. Besides, the heat shell isn't that great. It's only meant for side shots. Like, frontally, you need yeah, to get frontally, it's not going to do much. I guess that's fair, but... The ram itself is just made for taking a punishment, I find. Because you've seen, if you've ever seen some of the stuff I pulled off in the ram, like, I've taken shots from a number of tanks. They've never gone through. Like, there's some things that have gone through, but, like, you get the idea. Like, they, they haven't really gone through the armor. Which is terrifying. But even still. Let me check this real quick. What is this one? Alright, everyone ready up? Yep. Here we go. Already in the battle, we have Kanda proper. Because, you know, the American tree is technically the Canadian tree who put Canadian flags on it. <laughs> oh, we already all see, okay. Eight points down there. If I can get up far enough with the ram, I'm going to be able to deal a shit ton of damage. Alright, let's see. Oh, this map. Oh, dude. Alright, no. Could be worse. It could, could have gotten worse. a worse map. Guess I'm going in the chaffy. What's on our team? America, Russia, France, Sweden. That's not bad. That actually means we have any. If we have French heavy tanks, right? Like, we're gonna have. No, I'm thinking. 3-7 French heavies are is the ARL, uh, 44 ACL-1. That thing is a fucking beast at 3-7. Sure, it has low penetration, but it makes up for that with armor. And I've always, the thing that I've always hated the look of the AMX-13 M24. It just looks so bad. It doesn't fit together, you know? Look at that thing. It like, just doesn't look safe. Alright, I expect to probably get 10 frontally with this. I'm expecting to get probably side shot, front penned. Yeah, you're gonna get shot frontally. Oh. They're not gonna be on oh. sides. Oh, there's something like past that building. T34. Yeah, there's one something. on my left. I don't know where he is, and there's one on my right. Yeah. I can't fucking tell where that T3 is anymore. Or not T3, the fucking whatever. There's the somebody thing. driving right here on my marker. I don't know what that is. The light tank, for the looks of it. I can't see it. He's left side. In the way. We got stuff. We got something moving. Right there. Right there, on my marker. He's yeah. Moving. He's moving. We got a mover. We want to bounce something. No idea where, though. Oh, right in oh. front. Got a machine gun commander. I'm getting hit by everything in front. Oh, that's a Churchill. And then there's something I'm on the dead. right. Fuck. On the left, I can't see him. There's like everything everywhere. That's a Churchill. Once I get close enough, I'm gonna just drop artillery on the Churchill and the Dicker Max back there, alright? And they also got a, a flak cannon back there. Yep. Once I get close enough, I should be able to drop a shit ton of already on them. Mm. That's the help. Alright, I'm bringing the M4. So they're right there. I need to get. 
I need to go past this ship. They're over there. Oh, they're sniping in our spawn. Yeah, I'm aware. Got a kill assist. Oh, they try to snipe me. Alright, if I can get close enough, I can call artillery on them. I just directly. called artillery on a shit ton of them up there. Dropping it on them. Nice, keep that. Stab is on. I love my stab. Stab is One on the left great. and then two in the right right here. Yeah. I'm trying to get up to cover right now so they can't hit me. Oh, I can just use this KV-2 as, like, actual fucking body armor, essentially. Yes, you could. And I can do this. Buy knock it. Kill assist. Pushing up. Wait, the angle! Fuck. Maybe a bit more angle. Maybe... Mm. I don't have to help our friend here. Fucking Panzer for fucking shitter. Fucking, fucking remove that shit. Ooh, Baxter. I hate the Panzer fours like the shitty ass tanks as it is. Over designed, over complicated. Don't like them. I need cover. I got one to my right, one to my left. I can't spot this one right in front of me. Well, they're all wearing bushes, so you're never gonna find them anyway. Ah, uh, there you are, bastard. I can't hit him, though. He's behind a building. That's plain for me. Don't know. Somebody got him with artillery. Nice. I don't know what that is. That's Churchill. I'm on my way up. I might be able to deal with that Churchill. I'm in an M10. Dead. Fuck, he's dead. There's another one somewhere. Oh, I got shot on the right. Up there. Yeah. Wait, oh, wait, no. That isn't. I don't even know where I'm being shot from. You got shot by the plane behind you. No, there's a guy right here. Oh. Alright. He's in. He's in there. I can't hit him. Let me get up here, see what I can pull. Wheelie boy. Squeezy boy? Wheelie boy. Ah. These guys coming for me. You ain't getting away from me. Yeah, shoot your tires, get stuck. No, I've avoided detection so far. Damn it, Panzer IV got me. The wheelie boy, but he's low. Oh, I see. He just left that spot. Yeah, he's in that little, that little area. No, he left it. He's he's gone out of that spot now. I'm gonna risk it and hunt him down. Is he dead or is he still alive? No, he's still alive. He ain't capping to point. I'm arting it. That area. He shouldn't be able to move that fast. I shot off his, most of his tires. He still has to repair. Yeah, well, that's what I'm waiting for right now. Just gonna get to the top of here. Wiggle around Plains a little. Up. Watch out. Yeah, I'm aware. Use this Valentine as a makeshift shield. Coming for the dive. He's 
diving on me, no. We ain't diving on me. Can you give you cover? Watch out for the plane, this is gonna dive on you, I think. Where is she diving from? I'm gonna kill Sis on that little wheelie boy. Yep, I did too. Wheelie boy's dead. I'm gonna push up here. Alright, watch out. I think you're playing right above me, I think. Might be friendly? Mm, yeah, friendly. They're engaging him. Alright. Oh, we got one right in front of us. Apparently. Damn, I didn't hit him. He got my gun. Don't know what that is. Ah, he bounced. It was a Panzer IV. Nice. Repairing four seconds. Alright. Pushing up. Yep. Uh, I think they call artillery on that area. Back up. No, there was a Stu 42. Alright, I'm gonna go on my 63A. Well, we got bombed. Well, we won. Well, we won at least. <laughs> Anyway, thank you guys for joining me tonight. It's very much appreciated. Alright guys, so I'm going to call it here. Um, I just wanted to say thank you guys for coming out. It's always appreciated to see everyone come out. Tomorrow afternoon I'm going to stream. I'm just going to be streaming War Thunder again. Uh, Friday, I'm going to stream Trailmakers. And then after that, I have no idea. So we will see what happens. I know it was a shorter stream today, but it's an hour ten minutes. It's not overtly short. Um, here coming in June, I'm going to be starting to stream for longer amounts of time. So not yet, but in June. I'm going to start streaming for longer amounts of time, anywhere between two hours when I can. But regardless of that, thank you very much for, for um, how, Thank you all for coming out today. It's very much appreciated. I'll catch you guys tomorrow.